we have a very interesting funnel for our business. We get lots and lots of interest, but only a portion of that then goes into the next stage of wanting to know more. This means that we have to continuously keep learning as we manage the customers from the top of the funnel to the bottom of the funnel. The first step here is to understand the customer experience. How can we make the customer life better? And then using technology to enhance this experience. And automation then helps us do this. One of the big initiatives that I am particularly very happy about is our ability to stitch end-to-end -end journeys for select customer groups. I am very happy with the efficiency that has been provided by our machine learning mechanism, which scores or tries to classify customer behavior into higher propensity, middle propensity or lower propensity. We have tried to take away a lot of manual and human discretion out of our uh, bidding. So what machine learning drove for iPro was almost a 11% higher on ticket size, 42% growth in terms of cost of sales, as well as the same time a 10% higher numbers. Over the last two quarters, back between assets and automation, we have seen almost a 15% better result from search alone. For a life insurance, it's the highest number that I have seen among all clients. In performance marketing, that is probably the difference that we see is that everything is measurable. It's not about having just one big idea, putting it on TV or putting it on digital. It's about seeing that how your full funnel works for you, how you're attributing that to which part of the marketing and how to bring one coherent data strategy among all of that.